Stress can store fat around your waist. This is why. We are used to thinking of all stress as being harmful, but that is not the case. The acute stress response is beneficial. The acute stress response is designed to provide us with extra energy when we need it the most, when our life is in danger and we need to defend ourselves or escape. For example, exercise is stressful, but that's why it provides benefits. We adapt to stress and improve cardiovascular fitness and strength depending on how we exercise. Chronic stress, however, is detrimental. That's what we need to get a handle on. It has been known for a long time that uh, uncontrollable stress is associated with abdominal fat deposits. When women were exposed to stressful situations, it was found that the women with a high waist to hip ratio secreted significantly more of the hormone cortisol than the women with a lower waist to hip ratio. A higher waist to hip ratio was also associated with poor coping skills. Women exposed to stressful laboratory sessions over four days showed that the women with a high waist to hip ratio found these tests more threatening, performed more poorly, reported more chronic stress and secreted more cortisol. Lean women, but with a high waist to hip ratio, secreted significantly more cortisol than lean women with a low hip to waist ratio in response to familiar stress challenges. If you have a difficult time losing weight around your waist, it may be because of stress and increased cortisol secretion. The solution is to get more stress resistant, so stress does not have the same impact on you. This can be learned. There are several ways to deal with this. Meditation is one way.